Alpha Niner, calling Science Station Hermes. Alpha Niner, this is Science Station Hermes. Five by five. Roger Hermes, all cleared. Set to Gamma Delta Four. Request clearance for land. That's Roger, Alpha Niner. It's all clear in Sector Gamma Alpha 4. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Let's Play Master of Orion 2 Battle at Antares. I'm Czar Roger, and boy oh boy, we're going to get this game going. Ladies and gentlemen, we're on the next part. It's been a little while, but uh, we're going to get to it. And uh, we're going to make this one happen right now, folks. We're left off on 102. As you know, I'm earning 47 billion credits a turn. I'm at minus 11 because my fleet is getting just a tad big. I have five starting points. Then I have one from one star base. Ten from five battle stations. Six from Tachyon Communications. Four from Grac. So I have total 26 command points. But with my 13 destroyers alone, that's 26 points. My two cruisers, six. My one battleship, four. I have one non-combat, 37 total. Minus 11. So that's where we are. Our food, we're finally ahead. Man, we are going and blowing. And we're going to take a look at the colonies right now. We're going to try to balance the food output a little bit so we can get more production going. Oh, that's right, the anomaly. Okay, unfortunately, we're going to have to take advantage of that. We're going to move some people over here so we can increase production. This one, yeah, I'm going to be okay. So... That one just started in our last episode, so I don't think I have to recoup all that much. Uh, let me see. Let's go to the races. Yeah, that's not good. Sarzier is feud. Amios is okay. Kiki Tick. I've ignored him, but he's not happy. And these guys are where they are. It's calm. Feud. Unease. Can't make a treaty with them anyway. I just lost the... If I remember correctly, I just lost the spy on the last one. So, for my technology, I'm moving over to Neutronium Armor, Uridium Fuel Cells, which is sufficient energy to propel a ship 12 parsecs before refueling. And the Xeon Missile, which is the best missile there is. Carries a powerful explosive warhead capable of delivering 30 points of damage! There's multiple independent targeting... Versions, MIRVs, Emissions Guidance, Fast Traveling, Armored, and ECCM. Not bad. Electronic Countermeasures. So, anyway, that's where I'm going right now. And once I get that one, I'm going to zoom on over to Physics. But that's where I'm at right now. So, and then I'll determine what else I'm going to do from here on out. But that's where it is. Let's see. I'm sending the colony ship and a destroyer over to Pleads. And maybe Borea, too. I don't know. Yeah, that's a decent colony. I, I've got to expand fast. But I don't know. Oh, and by the way, if I wanted to extend range, I could on this asteroid belt or this planet, I could build a ship. Which, let's go to a planet. Let's go to this one. Can't do anything there anyway. It's an outpost ship. Capable of creating an outpost on any uninhabited planet. Outposts function like a colony, except no pollution. Sorry, populate. Well, pollution as well. No population units may be moved there. Outpost ships are unarmed and will be destroyed if not escorted by military ships. But it is a good way to extend the empire. So, we're at 425 research points. Let's take a look where we are. History graph. Man, I have fallen behind the Clackons and the Cylons. And uh, I've, I've got to grow my empire. So let's do it. Next turn. Combat at Archer. Now, nope, I'm okay. The Alkari are friends. There's not much I can do right now anyway. I might try to steal that second planet. But this is their capital planet. So the Burathi and Trelaran empires are now at peace. Yes, there's a space-time anomaly at Aleph. So... Remember the problem I had with my freighters? Well, I think I'm okay. I'm plus 40 on the freighters right now. So, I can't build a missile base there. Uh, but we'll see what we're going to do. So, we're plus 1 on the food. Plus 425. I'm going to have to get Orion eventually. But there it is. The Guardian. An evil, evil thing. Once I get Plasma Cannon, I'm going to take that rat bastard out. 
So I'll check to make sure no one's coming at me. Where's he going? Eh, it's like a cruiser destroyer. All right, let's go again. Human select combat here. Nope. Oh, he's already got a Titan ship. Sorry. Got your planet. Same thing here. No combat. I'm not taking these guys in. Oh, Mensa. Ancient Mensa. In Spanish, Mensa is like... Dumb, dumb, fool, Mensa. It's not like stupid. That's a stupido in Espanol. Lo and behold, you're getting a little bit of Spanish. Mensa Prime. It's now a human colony. It's a large planet. It's toxic. 13 total population points. So in other words, 13 million people. Mineral poor, but it's a normal G planet. So it can improve, but it will always be mineral poor. So don't have to worry about the food all that much. Just have to worry about defenses now. So I'm going to go straight to missile base. And that's how we're going to do it. So. They finished fighter construction. The Cylon and Trillinium Empires are now war. That's good for us. So let's go to Valkyr Prime. They built the fighter garrison. Okay. To the auto lab, baby. Right now. And I have to cough. Give me a moment. And we're back. So we're going to do an auto lab. I want them to grow as well, spaceport, but ground batteries. So I need more money. That's the plan right now. And that's good. How am I in my ooh, 859 points? Seven turns or thereabouts. Okay. Any ships coming at me? No. Let's take pleads. Let's go get it. Select colony ship for pleads. Uh, I'm gonna take. Wait, that's radiated toxic. Well, I forget which one's better, but don't matter. I'm gonna take the bigger one. Size always matters. Thank you. Medium radiated, 10 million mineral abundant. Yeah, that's not bad. We'll take pleads. I could have. I could have called it minor planet, but <laughs> that would have been miss taken or misunderstood so that's the way we're gonna do it for now we're gonna get that one going the Cylon and the Trillerans are now at peace Valkyrie 2 has created a radiation shield which is good oh oh boy here we go alert one alert one we have a battleship coming in notice how we drop down a point because we made a ship so I need okay yeah you've got to go over here I need more star bases so I can pull Mensa here to there. But please, my priority will be a missile base and a radiation shield. I'll probably be able to buy the missile base next turn. So my ship there in orbit has cover because I don't want it destroyed. But... How big is my fleet? Big enough. Three turns. Let's go. Now, you know what? I'm going to leave a ship here. Yeah, everyone else is going. So, I don't have the power to really engage them. My ships are really support ships at this point. They don't really have the firepower to engage anyone. I am a cheap guy. Meaning, I want my ships to last. So, I build them to last. That's my problem. So, please, right there. It's a mineral abundant. I'm going to get that one real quick. I'm going to go to my populace. I'm not going to ask them. <laughs> I'm going to get that. So, I'm going to increase taxes of 50% for one year, maybe two. Let's go. Let's do it again. The Sacra and Clacon Empires are now at war. So, the homie that's coming to visit me, the green guy, is now at war with the Clacons. So that's good. All right. I think I can now buy the, yep, the missile base. And I have money left over. Will I have enough for a radiation shield? It's possible. But I'm at max amount monies. So we'll see. That will allow me to defend my base. So I'm going to take a swig of my cherry coke. And we're going to move on. Leaders, has anyone declared war yet? 
No, they have not. Ah! Uro is at Rayal. Let's take a look at Rayal. That's right, it's growing. There's a lot of baby making going on right here. So once they do that, oh, I need ground batteries too. That's an effective weapon. So I'm gonna switch this order. There and there. That'll be good. All right. I like it. So my fleet will arrive in time and uh, we'll see. So let's take a look at the Empire. Battle Station Missile Base Ground Batteries. Should get an error base there as soon as possible. On Rayal, I was just there. We have a missile base. What are you building? The Star Base. Hurry up and build it, baby. Alright. No one else is coming at me. Let's go. Alright, I finished the colony ship. That's good. The Sakura and Klaken Empires are now at peace. I've christened a new ship, the colony ship. Alright, so I'm back up to probably minus 11. That's fine. Since I have a fleet in orbit, I'm going to do this so they can train at another colony ship. Alright, so I don't have to check any others. Man, I have to cough again. Forgive me. Alright. The good thing is no one is coming at me. I'm not at war with anyone. Life is good. All right, please. Do I have enough? Yes, I do for the radiation shield. You see, it costs 300 billion credits. That's a lot of money. Of course, if Da Vinci were here, he would be telling me something about their credits, dude. Not billion credits. Oh, well, it says they're billion credits. He says it is unnecessary in the manner in which I refer to them as. Uh huh. Look, I know I have a varied lexicon, dude, but even that's a little high for me. So, let's go ahead and see what happens. They're going to blockade my planet, but big deal. I'm going to hold on to it. So, the next planet I'm going to take... Let me see. I'm not so certain I want Borea. Ezra, Ezra. Where's Ezra? Why didn't I go to Ezra? What's there? Nothing. Let's take Ezra. Small planet. No one's there. I don't have to share with anyone. But I'm not going to have the color ship go alone because if it did and something's there, it'll be destroyed if it doesn't have cover. So, there we are. All right. That little rat bastard's got to get away from my planet. I don't like him. Me no likey having him there. I, I need that star base. It's got to give me one point. It's going to give me one point. Got to convert them all to battle stations. Here we go. Oh, he took the colony ship. So is he going to go to war with me? We'll see. We'll know right now. No, he didn't. So that means my colony is not, you know, blockaded. Well, that's good. So I can grow normally. Royal, keep going, baby. Keep going. Maybe I'll put one here. Yeah, me likey. Okay. Oh, that's a that's a Titan class starship. Or battleship or whatever. Alright, we're on turn one oh eight now. Ew. Let's uh, see. Okay, no one else is coming at me. Let me check out in the info. Oh man, they're really starting to get ahead of me. The, the Mechlars have beaten me on technology now? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we need a full a full change in what the Empire does here. We've got to put more people. Okay, now I need those 30 points. We, we, we have to put more people to do this. I got to get up to 500 minimum. Okay, well, that's not going to matter because they're lost in La La Land. I'm going to have to see how I'm going to get there, but I'm already at 471. Kier's going to head up. Oh, no, no, no. I need that one. I got a 478 with the 30 points of that auto lab in two turns. Oh, look. 29. See, once I get plasma cannons, kids, I can pretty much take out anyone I want. Oh, look at that. Plus 30 on the trader now. Woohoo! Okay, they finished the colony ship, so we're going to go back and create another colony ship. No, 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 go back. 
No armor barracks. Waste of time. They're not gonna get to my colony. I don't need armor barracks. Okay. The Sakura and Alkiri are now at peace. They're just attacking everyone, man. And Aleph is still in the time war. I'm not at war to anyone. No need for spies. I know they're spying on me. Okay. I can send my fleet back to Earth. Yes. To Earth. Okay. They didn't take any one of those planets, so Ezra's on its way. Altair. No, I already have one there. Borea. Let's do it. Pleads, pleads, yeah. I'm probably going to have to take the... I'm going to see if I can get the other planets and pleads. Where's he going? Oh, the Clackon fleet. Rat bastards. Well, they may not necessarily take it. Four turns. You know what? I'm going to have him go here. This guy can stay here as well. So those four will head back. This guy orbiting. What did I do? Moron. Alright. This is what's going to head back. And I'm going to have a destroyer stay there, pleads, and another one go to Borea or Sack. Uh, maybe not. Altair's okay. I just have that guy sitting there because I want him to sit there. Alright, Autolab is finished. Okay, someone just built the star base. So I'm at minus 10. Let's keep growing, see what happens. Ah, oh, I'm not 51 on this. Nope, we're not at war. Life's good. No combat there either. Yes, I'll take Ezra. That's the way I'm going to do it, right there. I need a left back. Okay, that'll do for now. I'm getting into hyper defensive mode, so I gotta. Based on the priority of what I'm building, I wanna get the missile bases out of the way. And look, I have another star base coming online. So that should help me. I'm at minus nine. See how the money's going up? It's at least 10 billion per, per point. That's how much each one costs me. See? Ship maintenance costs are 28 total command points. Plus 10 times 9 equals 90 billion credits. Wow, mama! That's a lot. That's a lot of money. Build the star bases. So anyway. Let's get it done. Uh, I've got to build the missile bases. So let's continue to move. And let's see. No combat. See? All tear, they're fine. No war, no nothing. Anything could... Yeah, they took Borea. These are right on my doorstep. Ugh. Come on, guys! I want this already! But those Xeon missiles are incredibly effective on my missile batteries. So it makes, right now, pretty powerful, my colonies. If they have a missile base, we're in good shape. I'm going to spend the money right here to get a little bit ahead on this. Because it's going to be built anyway. It only costs me 150 Remember, that's my marker. That's what I like to spend. 150 or less. I say 14 turns. That's a, that's a lot. Okay, dude. You're going to go over here. See, I'm now at 519 points. But the food. Okay, you're going to go back over here. So I need Saul to continue to rise in power. All right. Let's take a look over here. Damn, Nicklars. I am getting behind everyone. And me no likey. Whoa, what happened? You idiot. You sent the wrong ships. What a shock. Alright, look. I'm going to leave a cruiser there. I'm going to send another one back. I want one at Saul. 
So since I have these guys sticking around, yeah, I don't like that. I want them out of here. So my colony ship is coming back here. Would be a good planet to take. So I took Borea. I want Zenith. Uh, happy, 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 happy. No, 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 no. Cyru. What am I gonna take? Nope, looks like they're all being taken at this point. So I've got to expand the empire. Who are these guys? These are the Trillerans. I'm not a war against them, but I want to see... Yeah, you know what? They, they might have some colonies available. Oh, I got a battleship on Valkyr? Wasn't paying attention. Oh, that's right, because I wanted to dissuade the Clackons. No, wait, wait, wrong ship. I'm forgetting how to do this. Okay, I'm going to send someone, so I'm going to send this guy. Okay, that means the battleship stays in orbit. And since my enemy is over here, I want to hit... What, did I mess it up again? No, he's going to Inari. This guy is going to Sol. Okay. That's what we're going to do. That's how we're going to do it. Alright. I might rotate my ships. I like doing that. Makes me feel better that I rotate my ships throughout the Empire. Like they're giving them different assignments. Some go to Tokyo, some go to Singapore, some go to, you know, everywhere. All right! A little late, but all right. So everything is automatically updated except on your ships. If you have pulse and missiles on your ships, they're going to stay pulse and missiles. But I almost have all the technology I want so I can start taking the offensive. Retool all my ships and take the galaxy. Colony built on pleats, too. Oh, you idiot! You took the colony ship! Ah, oh, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. Wasn't I thought it was a colony ship, and I erred big time. Alright. So, well, whatever. It's alright, I'm down to minus eight. The Mechlars and Trillerian Empires are now at war. Alright, whatever. I blew it. Well, I've got another colony ship coming online in two turns and another one in three turns. I'm at 520 points. Let's see. I need more money. I need more moolah. I need more quan. But I'm still alive. I'm not at war with anyone. It's good. Other people like to fight war in these games, and yeah, it's fun. But I like to do it from a position of power. See, I'm going to send him that way. Have I checked out Atana yet? Yeah, I have. Have I gone to San San? Yes, I have. How about Ira? 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 Nope, but I'm going there now. So now that I have extended range, I've checked out those. Can I check out this? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go see that one. I've already checked out Tristan and Siru. Yeah, yeah. But I may be able to be in range now of... Me no. No, but at least I got range one more. So, okay. Let's take a look at our colonies. Yes, it's the micromanaging. Uh, dude, why are you doing that? I don't want Rial to do this. I want it to build. Build. Continue to build. That's all I want from you, Rial. Don't, don't put anyone to farm. Don't, don't be... Don't try to be productive. Just do what you're told, pal. This is a dictatorship. Don't take the initiative. Okay, Inari. No planets are available. Altair. Oh, it looks like they took the last colony. Okay, built a Hellcat. Ugh. Okay. I'm going to use this as a place saver now. I'm not going to build any more ships. So, my Hellcat's going to be a place saver. I'm really not going to grow any more ships. Okay, this did a freighter fleet. Where are we at? Fighter garrison, spy, pollution, spy, astro renewer, terraforming, and spy again. And I think that's it right now. We still got the space time 
anomaly at Aleph. Can my ship leave orbit? Yeah, it's just a planet itself. All right, so what do we have here? Big fleet. Okay. We not, we can't see... Oh, I can see Trillar. So that means my colony ships would be in range. So if there were any ships or planets that I could have colonized, I could have colonized them. Colonized them with my ships, but no. All right, let's do this again. Continue. Altair, nope, nothing going there. Oh, look at that. You see? Could have had a colony ship right there, right now. Yes, I know. And there's one. I need some more colony ships. So do it. I may need some more escort ships as well. So Trill is going to go there. Yep, let's check out that empty planet. So Saul is going to send this down to Trill. They're going to remain in orbit. So you see, I'm back up to minus 11 because of that stupid destroyer. I've already checked out Colossa. No. can't believe I haven't done that. Let's do it. Take the whole fleet on a sojourn. Okay, I'm going to get Neutron Blaster and Neutron Scanner. Neutron Scanner detects enemy ships, has a base detection range of 5 parsecs. Ships in, ships in transit can be detected at 1 parsec per size. Class of ship, greater range. Neutron Scanners reduce enemy ships' missile evasion by minus 40. Yep, but I want Plasma Cannons. Let's do it. Ooh, 100%. I didn't get it. Look at this. Two planets in Colossa of a friendly empire. Moron. Uh, Mutlat. Q. Uh-oh. An audience with the mighty empire has been reluctantly called. Your empire is pathetic. The Burathi, I suggest you offer Grand Bird and I continue to be in our favor. Death spores. This is going to lead to war if I say no. No. And they declared war. Alright. That's going to have ramifications. So we are now on war footing, ladies and gentlemen. As we continue to expand our empire, we've got to make sure we have everything. But at this point, I just need to hold out. Okay, they created a fighter bait, a fighter garrison. Okay. Research lab and star base. Oh! Ground batteries. Need to keep this in priority. Okay, where are the Burathi? Let me see these rat bastards. These guys are in the darker orange. So. Q. Let's go over here to Markab. Oh, wait, no. I've already been there. These are Trillerans. Where are the orange guys? Wait. Oh, here they are. They're brown. Doesn't look brown. Alright. I don't see any wormholes right now, so... I'm not impressed. But they can start throwing everything and anything at me. Like spies and stuff. And those aren't fun. Dude, you've got to get out of there. I don't know what technology they have. I can see... No. I can ask for a report. Um, okay. They're a ruthless expansionist. This is what they have. Technology-wise. Alright, fine. Let's take a look. Info? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to take these rat bastards out. So, I'm going after them. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. But I don't have the fleet to do it yet. Please. I'm going to start getting... I'm going to start tooling my fleet to go to war with them. 
Um, am I in range of any of their planets? No, we're only in communication range. I don't know what's there. Okay, Ira, go there. Ira didn't have anything, right? They were fully loaded. Okay, so we are now at a state of war. Let's take a look at our war preparations. Colony by colony, let's have a... Let's, as they would say, let's have a diagnostic. Altair, um, they don't have any weapons, so let's make it happen. Let's start spending money, 235. See, now I can't buy it. Buy it. I should have bought the one on Ezra. But Altair has more value to me right now. Uh, excuse me while I cough again. All right. Don't have the money to do very much, but I'm going to be saving my money in the event an invasion fleet shows up at my doorstep. I'm not afraid of them. I really am not. I'm looking to get a base, and Trill will probably be my base of operations where I'm going to go to war from. Uh, they're not very technologically advanced, so I'm going to go to see if I can get some sabotage stuff done. I'm going to go to war with them. So I can blow up things. See what happens. Alright, next turn. Mark Ab. Nothing there. Altair. Yeah, I already have it. Oh! Neutron Blaster. Neutron Scanner. Graviton Beam. Planety, planetary Gravity Generator. Creates an artificial gravity to normalize a planet to standard gra Oh yeah, right, right. Heavy planets can become good planets. That's a good thing on the heavy ones. And a Tractor Beam. It requires one tractor beam per size class of target ship to completely stop the target. Yeah, you can keep them motionless in battle. It's kind of cool. But I don't use that one. The human and Barathe are now at war. Really? Are we really at war? I, I am glad you're here to tell me these things. I'm going to go check out that one right there. Is Raiden in range? No. There's a lot of them in range. I'm going to dispatch this ship to Dame. And will it reach here too? Yeah. I should have been detecting these a while ago. So since I'm minus 12, I'm starting to lose money again. But selling food, extra food helps me, which is not a bad thing. All right. Altair did it. Ezra. Ezra may be my base of operations against them. No! <laughs> it's pretty close. Anyway, we're now on turn 116. We're going to be ending real soon because I want to shorten these episodes. But let me check my leaders. We're all doing well. Yeah, look at that. My plus 30. Oh, that's sweet. Uh-oh, where are you going? Okay, get out. Are there any plants I can take and board right? No. Nope. If I go bomb the colony, it's instant war. So, let's move on. Noptua? There's nothing there? Ah, Starbase completed. At Fakar. Or Faker? <laughs> it's Fakar. Okay, it's 6 of 7. You saw that, right? <coughs> Sorry, 6 of 7. But if I get Biospheres, I can add 2 more. So, I'm going to create... I'm going to build ground batteries, radiation shield, and spaceport, and auto lab, and subterranean farms. So I'm really stretching that one out as to what I'm going to build next. And everything else is fine. Okay, not too like he's here. What hut? There. There. Nothing. This one's going to head back to Valkyr. You see, now I'm at 30. All right. I'm okay. Look at what this does. Soil enrichment. That's the one I'm building right now. Using nanomachines, planetary soil can be molecularly enriched and fertilized, increasing the food a farmer can harvest by one. Soil enrichment will not work in barren, radiant, and toxic planets. But some of those plants can be converted to good planets where you can have it. 
Case in point, when the game began, you'll notice a lot of these were no farming, period. But I believe Aleph was converted and Fakar, this one was converted as well. So good things can happen. So I have a colony ship here. Yeah, dude, you've got to send it out. Take this and this to escort it. And right now we're going to send it to Ezra. So it's kind of in range to get somewhere. But I have two colony ships coming online very soon. Another auto lab, another plus 30. How am I doing over here? I am about to catch the Clackons, and the Mechlars are booming. The purple kids over here, they're, they're doing fine. Because they're factories and building up their empire. Dame! Ugh. But there's a stable wormhole there. Valkyrie Prime. Ground batteries. Very good. Okay. I need a supercomputer here. And how long for a battle station? Yeah, I need a battle station at Valkyr. This is a home star system. So I'm going to do that. And I think we're okay. So Dame will take me to Thuban. Let's check out Thuban. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. How far is Thuban? Three. So if I go there, it's one. Come back, it's two. No, I want it to go over to this one. Come on, don't be stupid. Thank you. Go that way. Okay. This guy is going to head north to Thuban. That's what we're going to do. More colony ships? Nope. That one's still available. I hope it is. So let's go one more. Trill. There it is. Not a war, so... Oh! And there we go. Sacras and the humans. Emperor Sirzir of the Sacras and Emperor Zar Roger of the humans have been nominated. Thank you, allies. That's no surprise. I want to be friends. The Alkari, thank you. I will remember you when I take your planets. Uh-oh. The Mechlars. The Barathis abstain. I'm shocked. They don't like the Sakura. 16 votes, and I, 16 votes to 15, and I haven't even voted yet. And yes, it's going to piss off the Sakura, but I'm going to vote. I have 13 votes, but it doesn't get me to the magic number. Neither leader has a two-thirds majority, so I piss them off by voting for me. Can you imagine that? Oh my god, they're back! They're back! Let's take it! Ole, 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 ole! I just like the music. Alright, I got it. Alright, this will form a forward base for us. And I'll even put a star base here. Alright. We're gonna spend money on this forward base. I got another auto lab. All right, Royal Prime, Mikov. I'm gonna leave this one ready to go. So Royal Prime, this is that super huge colony. I want it to build stuff. But while it gets there, I'm gonna do a research lab, make some money, more research. I'm okay on that fighter garrison let's do a battle station all right let's get to it all right folks i'm now minus two on the food oh 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 oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness look at that we have a barathi battle fleet on its way all right the trills may take it but i have to have, make sure i have the money for it okay which which, which plan did i take uh, trill, trill, trill. Here it is. Am I going to have enough money? I'm short by 130. I'm going to make 101. It's two turns away. It. I don't think it knows I'm there yet. <laughs> but it's about to find out. Uh, 
let's uh, put our taxes up a little bit. So, sorry. Yeah, as a one-turn tax increase, I need to make sure that we have enough. All right. Ra uh, Fakar, come back. Oh, no, wait, wait. Yeah, oh, look, now I'm back up to 650 points. Wow. Yeah, you're a little behind, aren't you, pal? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to leave this one ready to go for the next turn. Um, I need the money. I'm not going to build anything. So you are going to do that. All right, folks. We're going to leave this one right here. We're going to save this one. Yeah, I can't spell. Oh. Let's save it. I love how it says invalid. And we're going to end it. So. Battle cometh with the Blarothi in turn 121. Folks, we're out of here. Peace.